After years of planning and massive construction work, the flagship city food hall along North Park Row in downtown Erie is now open. It is another one of the stories we're following tonight. Yeah, today was the public's chance to check it out. Our Lisa Adams watched people streaming it out all day. She joins us live. So, Lisa, what do they think so far? A lot of people that I talk to just can't believe this is Sherlock's and Park Place. It's entirely transformed. But most people are telling me they're pretty excited about all the diverse food offerings for downtown Erie and what this means for revitalizing downtown. For months, Erie has watched the transformation from outside Flagship City Food Hall, and now they're ordering food on the inside. Oh my gosh, yes, so many choices. I'm going to start with uh, the shawarma station today, and I guess tomorrow I'll try a different one. This is, like I said, a great option uh, for downtown Erie. The legal community, just some of the downtown workers likely to be regulars here. Working down here, I saw the progress over the years, and it's nice to see the finished product. It's great for the downtown. It's a sign of progress, and everyone's done a great job with all this. Nearby Gannon University students and staff also checking it out on day one. Well, everyone loves variety. In fact, we have a lot of people from the community come into our dining hall, but you know, it's always nice to have other options and a great way to support our community partners. After years in the works, the EDDC wondered what day one would be like. Well, it's lunchtime now, and you can certainly see the crowd. We're going to ask this guy, do you work downtown? I do. I work at Northwest Bank up on 8th and State Street. So what do you think of this so far? It's a great venue, great food. Come out and support local, everybody. To support local, I tasted this savory pastry from Blue Willow Bakery, one of nine food vendors, each preparing diverse offerings and thrilled to serve their first customers. And just to see these um, faces come in, and I'm in a new opportunity like this downtown, um, the renovation was, it took some years, but we're finally here, and it's, it's, it's amazing. It's what operations manager Corey Cook has been hoping for. It's been a lot of hard work, three years of construction. Uh, we're finally here um, to see it packed with a diverse group of people, um, diverse vendors, that's a great day. And if people thought that it would be mostly a lunch crowd here because of folks who work downtown, well, the way the crowd looks tonight is proving otherwise. And again, we're talking diversity. Here's Dina's uh, Dominican kitchen. But in here, if you follow me, Dave, Noodle Love is cooking up some noodle dishes. And on their shirts, it says food. City. Reporting live at the new flagship city food hall, Lisa Adams, Erie News Now.